What is peace? And what is justice? Is peace taking a picture of the chapel and looking at its beauty? Or is peace sitting with my dog and knowing how loved I really am? And is justice being a part of campus ministry? Or is justice going down to Mississippi to serve others? Lucky for me, I found the meaning of peace and justice in Ecuador. Wherever we went, we were welcomed with love and smiles, not to mention, we got a few hugs as well. The compassion, the hope, the fight, and the desire that these people had was like no other I've ever witnessed. Whether we were in the slums of Quito, in the tiny village of Pijal, or playing with the peacemakers, I could see the justice they were all working towards and the peace that they shared wherever they were. While in Ecuador, I realized that peace and justice are not things we have to strive for, but something that we can create. The community in Ecuador made it clear that being kind, caring, and showing love is all that someone needs to create a peaceful, just society. The sense of community that I felt in Ecuador was like no other that I have ever felt in my entire life. I hope to one day strive to be as good and as amazing as these people are. Ecuador was an experience that let me look at peace and justice through a clearer lens. The coolest part is that peace and justice are found everywhere. You just have to have a little hope. Respecting each other, denying thy brother. A war's going on, but the reason's undercover. The truth is kept secret, it's swept under the rug. If you never know truth, then you never know love. What's the love, y'all? Come on, I don't know. What's the truth, y'all? Come on, I don't know. We found extreme forms of peace and justice in the streets of Providence, and I still find it every day. So, yes, peace may be holding my dog, and justice may be serving others. But more importantly, it is the outlook one has on life and on change that makes peace and justice so evident all over the world. Thank you, Ecuador, for this unforgettable experience and these life lessons that I will carry with me forever. Most of us only care about money making Selfishness got us following the wrong direction Wrong information always shown by the media Negative images is the main criteria Infecting the young